Okay, so we're going to do our launch. Should take about 20 minutes or so. Hopefully, we'll get done right during halftime. So on your phone, okay, I need you to go to vrays.org, V-R-A-I-S-E.org, vrays.org, and then click the Get Started Now. And it's going to ask you for your first and last name and an email address and a password. Uh, you can use whatever email you just you use the most, whether it's a school email or a personal email or whatever. It doesn't really matter. And you can just pick an easy password and then click Get Started. Okay, so again, go to vrays.org, V-R-A-I-S-E dot O-R-G, and then put your information in. If you have any questions during this process, you can just sort of unmute yourself and just ask. Okay, so after you put your name and email in and your password is going to ask you to upload a picture of yourself. Again, what this picture does is it sort of assures the donors that this is not a scam. Okay, there's your picture uh, and there's the, the logo. So this is a, a something I can donate to without feeling like I'm getting ripped off. Okay, so just click upload a picture from file. Um, if you have a, a football uniform type picture, that'd be awesome. It doesn't really have to be. Just as long as they can see your face, that'd be that'd be all you need. So I'm going to click select photo. And then once you get to the join the fundraiser, um, there's going to be a code that it will ask for. Okay, it says enter join code here. And the code is on the screen here it is 147 875 zero three and then click join now okay so let me go back a few pages here so go to vrays.org put your name and contact information in there upload a picture and then there's the code again one four seven eight seven five zero three i'll wait on the screen for a minute or so make sure everybody gets logged on <laughs> Once you enter this code, so you really shouldn't have to do it again. If you've done a vertical raise fundraiser this year, you're already in the system, you could just simply log in and then enter that code and then just click the UP All Star Game link there. It'll be in blue. And you can actually just reload any prior donors if you've been in the system already. Okay, so we got 19 logged in so far. So I'll wait another little bit and then we'll get rolling. Okay, the code again, one four seven eight listen, seven listen, listen. zero three. Oh, the v raised fundraiser. Do you have to get the app? No. Nope. You it. You say for the so it may take you to this screen, call us the home screen, where there's a blue line at top where it says participant menu. Just click on that participant menu Sorry. line. Sorry. Uh, invite user. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Okay, so this is our invite wizard. Yeah, this is the four steps that we're going to do today. We're going to text our parents and our coaches. We're going to put in emails. Hey. We're going to put in first number. text numbers in our system. And then we're going to share it on social media. Okay, so the first thing I want you to do is click on that top white and blue line where it says oh. parents. Okay. And I think somebody's unmuted. Let's see if I can maybe mute some people here. Yep. Okay. Gotcha, that will help now. Okay, so click on that white and blue top line and then click on the little green phone circle. What it does is it auto populates your landing page to a text. Okay, so what I want you to do is text that to any parent that you have, mom, dad, stepmom, stepdad, and also text it to your coach. Okay, so spend about a minute, okay, texting parents 
and coaches, but just those people. We'll, we're going to text some other people coming up here. Okay. So text your parents and your head coach. Okay. Look, let me go back here. And here's the code again, if you missed it, 147 87503. And then click on participant menu and then invite wizard. And then this is what our invite wizard looks like. Right now we're working on texting parents and coach. Click on the top white blue parent line and then click on the little green phone and then text your parents. Okay, I'll give you about another 30 seconds to do that. And then we'll go on to the most important step, the email step. All right, still half time, so we're doing good. <laughs> Okay, so our next step, go back to that invite wizard and then click on the second line where it says email and then a white box will appear. It says enter or paste email addresses here. You could put all your emails in that box. Okay, just separate them either by a comma or a space. Okay, so stick them all in there and click send. Okay, and this is probably the most important step. We'll get most of our donation money from emails. Okay, so this is a pretty important step. So I'm gonna give you a little bit of time to get this done. If you have those emails in the notes app in your phone, just copy them there and go back to here and paste them all in, okay, and then click send. If you get an email sent back to me, to you, excuse me, um, you may have spelled it wrong, okay, or somebody else may have gotten to that person first. Okay, we have some, quite a few teams that have more than one player. So we only send a person one email invite. Okay? We don't want to spam up their email with a bunch of with a bunch of requests. So but if you get an email kicked back to you, you just simply have to add an email later on. Okay. So put all your emails in that box and then click send. Okay, I'll give you a couple minutes to do this. Again, this is probably our most important step. sort of the minimum here, I mean, minimum is 20 emails. That's typically what I tell teams that I run where their goal for each athlete is 500 hours. Okay. Our goal is a thousand hours for each athlete. So we have some pretty lofty goals. So it's probably going to take more than 20 emails. Okay. Anything that we do right now, you, you can do again in the next 21 days. Okay. I'm going to say that again. That's really important. Anything we do right now, you can do again in the next 21 days. Okay. So during the second half of the game, okay, during commercials, okay, add more emails, text more people, reshare it on social media. Okay. Very important. Our system will take up to a hundred emails. Okay. So you can really load them up. Okay. I got Wyatt Gamers with 29 emails. Awesome job, Wyatt. Lucas. Cisco has 27 emails. Nice job, Lucas. Michael Boucher has 20. Travis Harkas has 18. Hayden has 16. Ryan Tonight, 16. Caden, 10. Okay. And so far, everybody else is under 10. So I'm going to give you a little bit of time to get this done. Well, Probably the best place to get emails is just sort of sit down with mom or dad and just kind of go through their contacts. And I think I have like 4,000 contacts in my phone. So coming up with, you know, 50 or 60 e emails would be pretty easy, actually. Okay. And also parents, they have your link. Okay? They can also add emails into the system or text people or, you know, send them a Facebook message or whatever. We're just simply inviting people to the party. Okay. Whether they come to the party or not, totally up to them. Up to them. We're just inviting people to the party. Okay, one more minute for emails, and then we'll go to the next step.
again, if you don't have your emails, you can just keep working on this. We can, we can come back to it. So click on the next button here and let's go back to that invite wizard and click on that third line where it says text and then click on the little green phone again. And you, you should have some text context numbers in your phone, okay? Only send one text at a time though, okay? Emails, you can send up to 100, but let's just send one text at a time. We don't wanna spam up people with a group text, okay? Unless you have like a family group text, you can put it in there, or maybe like a work group text, put it in there, okay? But let's typically send one text at a time. So I'll give you a, a few minutes to add your text numbers in there, okay? So again, click on the third line where it says text, and then click on the little green phone and it'll auto populate your landing page. Okay. So I'm gonna have you add your text numbers in there and I'm gonna give you a few brain triggers that might trigger some other people that you can text. Okay, so I'll give you a, a couple minutes to get that done. Hey, we got a hundred bucks so far. Nice. You'll be amazed how quickly this will build. Okay. By the end of the Lions game, we should have five grand. Okay. If everybody's sort of doing what they're supposed to do. All right. Still had time. So we're doing good so far. So right now we're putting text numbers into the system one at a time. Hey, somebody give you some, I call them brain triggers, uh, just some ideas of who else you can text. Okay. So think of somebody that will love to watch you play in the All-Star game, but it's just too far for them to travel. So maybe they're out of state or they got to drive a long way to get there. Okay, So think of you know somebody, you, you might be able to come up with like two, three people with each one of these brain triggers. Okay, So somebody that would love to watch you play the game, but it's just too far to travel. Okay. So second half of starting here. So we'll, we'll keep trucking and you can kind of keep rolling here. We're almost done. Next person text, think of somebody that's at a holiday dinner of yours, like a Thanksgiving or a Christmas dinner. Uh, text somebody that was at that dinner. Maybe it's a family member, maybe it's a neighbor or a friend. Um, somebody that's at a holiday dinner of yours. Again, each one of these brain triggers, you might come up with two or three ideas. Next person to text is somebody that you could consider a mentor of yours. Maybe it's a boss or a manager at work, or a teacher or a former coach. Okay. Text somebody that you would consider a mentor. Maybe it's an alumni of your school. You guys have some awesome alumni from your schools. So let's make sure we invite them to the party.
Next brain trigger is text. A parent of a friend of yours, okay, that's not playing the game because they're already texting those people, okay? So think of two or three or four friends of yours. Uh, maybe it's a girlfriend, maybe it's a friend, maybe it's a coworker, okay? Text their parents, okay? So text the parent of a friend of yours. You got about probably two, three more minutes. I'll get you back to the game. Next person to text, think of somebody who's got a really nice car or a really nice house. Okay. Think of somebody that has a really nice car or a really nice house and text that person. Lines need to step up here. I'm going to stop. I'm sort of watching both games. <laughs> Okay, so our last step, you go again, go back to that invite wizard. And if you have a social media, Facebook or Twitter, click on that bottom line, okay, and just share it on your social media. Okay. We also really encourage your parents to share it on their social media. Okay. We'll get more action from your parents' social media than your social media. Okay. So really make sure you share that on yours and their social media. Okay. If you have an Instagram, let me give you a bit of a workaround. If you go back to that invite wizard and you click on that paperclip, okay, above where it says parents, that will copy your landing page link. Okay. Then you got to go to Instagram. You got to edit your bio. You got to put that link in your bio and then create a post where somewhere in that post that says click on my bio to donate. So it's sort of a workaround for Instagram, you can't put a link in a post in Instagram, but you can on Facebook and Twitter. Okay, so our last step is to share to Facebook and or Twitter. Okay, so remember we have high goals here. Okay, what I need you to do is log in to your account every single day. Okay, and so far we have 100 bucks raised. Awesome job. And if you scroll down, it will say thank you to our supporters. Okay, so most people they'll leave their name. Okay, if they go donate money, some people would do anonymous, which is fine. But if one of your supporters donated, make sure you send them a thank you email or a thank you text. Okay, and we want to make sure that we keep adding people into the system. Okay, keep resharing on social media, and let's hit our goal. Hopefully, in the next twenty-one days, we can hit our goal. Keep an eye on how much you've raised, okay? Because if you haven't quite raised a thousand dollars, you got some work to do, right? Okay, you may have to hit up more people. You may have to hit up some local businesses. Um, just basically give them your landing page link, and they can donate here. Okay, so let me stop sharing here. Does anybody have any questions? You can either post it in the chat, or you can unmute yourself. Let me check the chat real quick. Okay. Yep, let me share the code again. Again, the code is, let me go back to over here, 147-875-03. I'll put that in the chat. Okay, 147-875-03. Okay, so if you don't have any questions, uh, we'll definitely be in touch. Keep an eye on your email, keep an eye on your text. And then uh, if you're playing a winter sport, keep on trucking. Okay, same thing with the spring sport, and we will get rolling soon. Talk to you soon. I'll stick around here for a minute or two if anybody has any questions.